When you think Harvard Med School, this is probably not what comes to mind. Her heart looks good. But it turns out you can learn a lot from a lemur. Which is why one class now partners students of human medicine, like Kara Young, with veterinarians to treat animals at Boston's Franklin Park Zoo. It's unlike any experience I've ever had, but it's really getting to know these animals just beyond um, what we can see here um, and knowing them inside and out. Today, these frogs are getting a routine physical. Check out his eyes. And while some things like mm -hmm. eye exams aren't much different. You notice the cataracts mm -hmm. in his eyes. Animals can't describe what they're feeling. That is super important in um, how we've learned in medical school, especially when a patient can't communicate with you. You got to look at everything else around the patient. The program gives students an opportunity to work with every animal at the zoo, no matter how big or small, like this pygmy hippo getting an ultrasound, or a dwarf goat who needs a checkup. Dr. Gilad Evroni, now an assistant professor at NYU School of Medicine, was the first student to go through the program. It was an experiment, and none of us knew what to expect. He now uses what he learned as he researches undiagnosed diseases. When you're presented with something that you've never seen before, you really have to think outside the box and be creative. Kara says what yeah. she's learning from these little guys will go with her as she graduates. Is this going to make you a better doctor? Absolutely. I think foremost, the hands-on experience is unparalleled. I would say that I've been learning so much in how to be creative with my technique. Getting a new perspective by taking a walk on the wild side. Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News, Boston. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.